girls? Well, I have a suggestion for you. Which, Which one? one? Girls, there's a month left before school. A month! Girls, I can't understand. Why such sour faces? High school is so cool. You and I will be high school girls. Diana, cool or not cool, but I love holidays more than school. Well, I don't mind going to school, but if there will be new, cool, beautiful boys, they'll be there, right? Oh, girls, if I only knew. But that's not the point now. I think it's time for you and me to go buy new office, backpacks, and some beautiful bags. I'm ready. However, I don't like school very much. But here's the office and bags to buy. I'm always glad. Will they let us go? Girls, I'm already writing to Mr. Mike. Mr. Mike, hello. We need to leave with the girls urgently. We want to shop for school. I want to tell you a big secret. I write novels. Yeah, you heard me. And now they're available in a new mobile game. Unique characters, love dramas, terrible secrets. I tried very hard to make them really interesting for you. And now you don't only read them, you change the course of the plot. Let's play? Diana, you've thought it all out. Are you sure you want to shop for school? Well, we'll also go into some cafe. Girls, Mr. Mike wrote okay. And he wrote that shopping for school is very important. Well, are you ready? Ready! Let's go! Lealia, I'm so scared. Yana, why are you scared? No one will notice us. No one saw anything. All right, we will steal two chocolates and run. We don't steal, we take. Okay, come on. So, Yana, we take one chocolate bar each. Yeah. I'll take this bagel with chocolate and this chocolate bar. Then I'll take this and this. Believe me, pizza won't count anything. Pizza won't count anything. How did you know that? Yana, it's not the first time I've done this. Now I will take chocolates every day. Girls, are you stealing chocolates from pizza? Why do you think that we steal it? We take it. We'll write everything down in the notebook. And we'll pay it off later. Listen, Browse, what are you doing here? Okay, if you can take it and write it down in a notebook, then I will also take a chocolate bar. Now we are not the only ones who know the secret. And Browse, too. Browse, don't forget to write it down in the notebook, okay? Yeah, I'll write it down in the notebook, just like you. So, Pizza, while I was away, I see a huge shortage at the checkout. Have you eaten chocolates? I see your sides have grown. Ice, I didn't eat chocolate bars. They just disappeared. I don't believe you. Guys, did something happen? It happened, Mr. Mike. Mr. Mike, we bought chocolates for our trailer. I put them in the shared refrigerator, but every day they've been disappearing. Ice is blaming me for eating them. Yes, she says she doesn't eat them. Well, where do they disappear to? Well, guys, let's go take a look. Maybe someone moved it to another shelf. There are no thieves in our country house. Let's go, Mr. Mike. But if you ate them... Ice, I didn't eat them. Mr. Mike, I'm telling you seriously. I didn't eat the chocolate bars. We need to find the thieves. Yes, yes. Didn't eat, didn't eat. We'll figure it out now. Hello, Hello Mr. Mr. Mike. Mike. Oh, Ice, you're back. Hello. Yes, yes, I'm back. Let's go figure it out. Wait, Browse, where did you get this chocolate bar? This one, I got it from the fridge. The girl said that I could take it, write it down in a notebook, and then only pay off. You had to ask permission from pizza. Here, here. See? Browse ate all the chocolates. Browse, you did the wrong thing. This is actually only the first one. Show who ate all the chocolates. Girls, show them. We were going to pay for everything today. I actually only took a chocolate bar for the first time. The Elliot ate the whole box. Damn, I'm in trouble because of you. I almost broke up with ice. That's it, pizza. Come to the trailer. Count how much they are there. You should pay off everything today. Guys, I thought there were no thieves in our country house. I didn't know it's forbidden. The girls did it, and I did it too. I don't know anything. Lealia, you made a mistake today. You usually do everything right. I give it all away. I don't owe anything. Well, Lealia, is it cool to eat it and knock it back? Very cool. I already know how much you owe. For 72 chocolates, 2500 Wow, your chocolates are expensive. I'll give it back tonight. Yes, Mr. Mike, something is wrong with your helper. Yes, Lealia made me blush today. That's it, Ice. No questions for me? Figured out for the chocolate? No, no, sorry, Pizza. I got excited. Lealia, I'm sorry, but I need to call your parents. It's a terrible act. Couldn't you stand up for me, Yana? Lealia, how? They caught you red-handed. Julie, I'm going to tell you this now. I was caught by Mr. Mike. Are you serious? If they kick me out of the car, they're definitely going somewhere. And there they go. Hey, frogs, take away your hands! Back, Back off, mascot! mascot.
I don't understand, girls. What's the problem? Where are you going, Bunny? Shopping every other day? Won't it be too much? We're sitting here. We're not going anywhere. And do you ride? We'll tell Mr. Mike everything. Girls, actually, Mr. Mike knows about it. We're going to get to the office to get ready for school. You can go too. We're on our own. You're on your own too. What are you saying? We will decide when we want to go. Dan, I told them to get their hands off the car. In short, girls, I understand that you are offended that we are going to the store and you are not. But here, look, a message from Mr. Mike. He let us go. Okay. okay. Girls, let's go put that on Mr. Mike. Girls, can we sell our second guard of frogs so that they won't be so offended? Just give it. They're so cute. Am I the only one who does not believe they are going to the office? We, we don't, don't believe, believe them either. either. Well, girls, shall we arrange back to school? Let's go shopping. Let's go. Boys, who knows where Abby's going? Just imagine she's going on a date, only I do not know with whom. I asked our boys, no one even knows her. Who is she going to meet? If I find out that one of our friends decided to hook up with her, it will be very bad for him. It's better not to mess with the Zoop. Zoop, calm down. Abby's going on a date with my ex-friend, Dima. What? Abby's up to something. She wants her appearance back. Well, I do not know that, but she's dressing up there. Well, boys, how do you like my new green leopard suit? Do you think Dima will like it? Cool suit. Wow, Abby's so risky. Well, I would go on a date with such a girl. Abby, what date? What does it mean? Hand away, Zoop. Do you think I'll be stuck here with you forever in this house? No. I want to go there, to a normal Abby, life. Abby, are you sure that if you hook up with Dima, you'll become like him? What if he becomes like us? I don't want to hear one more footballer. Oh, I hope everything will be fine, and I will become like him. Kostya, go look out. Has Dima arrived yet? Is Kostya the smallest to run and watch Dima come or not? Cool, only this house is not rubber. There are more and more of us. I don't like these football players. Zakat is Zelina's choice. Hello, Dima, former friend. Hello, Kostya. Why are you so cocky? So where's Abby? Your Abby's dressing up. So will you kiss Abby and become one of us? We'll see, but you know I won't give you my car. Dima, calm down. Why don't you come to our house? Say hello to everyone. Thanks. I'll wait here. And tell Abby I've already arrived. That's all. The final preparations. Boys, wish me luck. It's been a long time since I've been on a date. And I didn't mess with the other football players either. Good, Good luck, luck, Abby. Abby. Zoop, I feel sorry for you. Abby, you're not going anywhere. Only over my dead body. Zoop, I wouldn't humiliate myself if I were you. Zoop, I'm sorry, but you are already dead. But I'm a crush. Everyone says I'm a crush. Why don't you like me? Yes, unrequited love is difficult. In short, boys, we need to become normal. Just imagine how many girls will run after us. That's it, I have a goal to become normal and Abby will be mine. Dima, hello, I'm going to you. Here, Dima, your bride is already dressed up. Not a bride yet. Dima. Well, well, the kisses will wait. Come on, Zoop, calm down, we'll find you another girl. I like Abby. I don't understand. Why are we standing? All right, sit down. Let's go. I don't understand. And open the door to the lady? Okay. Dima, have fun. Thanks. No! Calm, calm down. down. Really, calm down. Zoop, that's it. Your Abby's gone. Ice, why are you wiping? Now everyone will come and wipe everything with their butt. Pizza, you said the wrong thing just now. It is necessary that there is always cleanliness near the trailer. Okay, I was joking. Bad jokes. Take a rag and wipe it too. We're, We're hungry. hungry. Gigi, what? What happened? I had to wait. The chairs are wet. The rain passed. Can you see I'm wiping? Thanks, but you said it too late. My underpants are wet now. Okay, I'm ready to take orders. What do you want? French fries. Burger. Strawberry mojito. Lemonade for me. Okay, guys, we'll get everything ready now. I'm shocked. Why couldn't the chair be wiped? Gigi, calm down. It's the heat. Now everything will dry out. It will dry out. Guys, guys hello, hello everyone. everyone. Today is our sports day. That's why we are all dressed up to do sports. Wow, what cool news. But why didn't you tell us yesterday? We came to the cafe. 
Yana and Lialia, I advise you to stay away from our trailer. He's very angry with you girls. We're angry with you too, Ice. I still haven't eaten a chocolate bar today. I want sweets. Hello, everyone. Has anyone seen Bunny today? We know they're our ex-girlfriends. We just want to have a conversation with them. Basketball players, we are frying fresh french fries. Come here. Basketball players, don't sit on these chairs. They are all wet and my underpants are soaked. Gigi, why are you telling everyone Patrick, this? Patrick, I'm just warning them. Basketball players, we don't follow bunny cheerleaders. They kind of went shopping, but that's what I heard from afar. Thanks, Thanks we'll, we'll see. see. So stop talking. Get up. Today we have to jump a hundred times with a rope, according to the plan, and run three kilometers. You know, Raz, I'm going to jump rope when I eat a big fat burger. Wow, Gigi, you're gluttonous. Are we waiting for the girls? According to plan? Of course, according to plan. Look, you're talking to Kanopa, only in an adult way, seriously, and I'm with Diana. I see. <laughs> Girls, this shopping was just amazing. I love buying office supplies for school. I bought so many different colored erasers. Girls, well, you saw what beautiful pens and colorful notebooks I bought. And I like the covers I bought for the books. Girls, boys seem to be waiting for you. Knopa, can I have a talk with you? Actually, I'm busy. Well, a few words. Okay, girls, go. I'll catch up with you. Diana, and I need to talk to you. Listen, Smile, I actually have unpacking plans. Come on, Timmer, I'm listening to you. Just hurry up, because I'm interested in unpacking. Here's the thing. Girls, write to me. They want to get acquainted. Wow, congratulations. Aren't you jealous of them at all? You know what, Knopa? When I have a girlfriend, you don't have to cry later. I won't console you. What makes you think I'm going to cry? Listen, Timmer, what do you want from me? I want you to come to your senses and come back to me because we're the perfect couple. Timber, that's what you think, that we're the perfect couple, and I don't think so. I'm going to unpack my erasers and pens. You'll regret it. Very beautiful girls, write to me. Do you hear? Timber, I wish you good luck. Bye. Well, the plan failed, and I was talking to her like an adult. I'm so interested in what Timber is going to tell Nopa now. Probably confessing his love. Your basketball players love you very much. Oh, Tally Man, but it seems to me that this is not love. They want to be with us because we are popular. Yes, we are popular, and they are the stars with us. Oh, look at the erasers I bought myself. So cute. And a pen, 10 and 1, and a donut pen. Maybe they don't want to be with you for popularity. Maybe you screwed yourself up. Mascot, you, you don't, don't understand, understand anything. anything. It's just that you're a boy, and that's why you stick up for basketball players. You should support us. Girls, I will always support you. I just feel sorry for the basketball players somehow. Someone has come. Diana, can I come in? Diana, well, I couldn't stand it. It's just some kind of harassment. Okay, Smile. Come in. Diana, just a few words. Nastia, we'd better leave. Okay, Smile. Let's just be quick. Without any of these confessions of love. All right, Diana, no confessions. I want to tell you, I have a date tonight. Cool, and? Diana, if you come back to me, I'll cancel the date, and there will be no date. Smile, you're acting like a loser right now. I understand that all this no, is a lie. No, it's not a lie. I'll show you her photo now. Damn, I'm without Listen, a Listen, Smile, I understand that we're not dating anymore, but if you want to, go on a date. You don't have to deny yourself anything, especially if this girl is beautiful. Diana, aren't you jealous of me at all? No. That's mean Listen, of you. Listen, Smile. I think it's mean of you to lie. To come into my room and just lie to my eyes about a date with a girl? I'm never going back to a boy who's lying to me. All right, Diana. I'll prove to you that I'm not lying. I'll write to her to come here. Okay, Smile. Good. I'm sure Timmer said Nopa the same thing. I like the toad I drew. Just like me. How do you like my description? Blondie, look, I drew you and me. We are like best friends. You and I are not best friends. You and I are just a team. Show your drawings. Wouldn't it be a shame to hang them over the bed? Blondie, you disappointed me. Since we are not best friends, my drawing will not hang over the bed. Blondie, you just offended Stella. It was such a beautiful drawing. You'd better give it to me. I don't like your drawings. Have you seen what Bunny's drawings are? 
money does I have drawings? They are printed. Here, they have the printed ones. And we have to draw it to be even cooler than Bunny. But we are not artists. You know, Blondie, we don't have any team. You won't be pleased. Okay, girls, let's not fight. Let's just draw again. This whole wall should be a frog's drawings. So, girls, let's get started. Draw again. Again, so again. Yana, Lialia, how much longer? Two, Two more, more laps. laps. Well, what do you have? She wished me luck. Diana didn't believe in my story. Basketball players, why don't you run? Aren't you athletes? One more lap. We are athletic. We train every day. What are we going to do now? In short, we really need to find the girls so that they believe. Oh, basketball players. Why are we missing? Haven't the new girls arrived yet? We really want to get to know them. <laughs> Very funny. They're coming tomorrow. Just do not fall from their beauty. So I saw that someone was cheating. Therefore, fine. Two more laps. Basketball players, come on. We'll be only happy for you. Okay, girls, let's go. There's nothing to talk about with them here. Oh, Bunny, you finally arrived from shopping. Excellent. Put down your bags and join the runners. Yana, Lila, you've probably forgot that we have cheerleading. We have practice tomorrow. And today we have the day off. Girls, I hope there will definitely be a training tomorrow. Is it all? Are we free? Losers, haven't you heard? Two more laps. No! One, two, three, run! Poor losers. It's strange that losers run around and you, Lialia and Yana, stand and command. To be honest, I'm sick of you rats. That's why we're rats, to command. We're in charge of the country house. Mr. Mike's assistant. Stop! We pulled away from them. Yes, we're walking now. Yeah, they found the last one. Why do we have to run? Yes, let's go at a brisk pace. Like we ran a circle. Look, they're trying to deceive us again. I'm going to arrange them for running. We need to run. Stop! Losers, are you the smartest here? Have you decided to deceive we us? Ran. We just thought that this was the end of the race. We don't intend to run anymore. Let's go have a mojito. Drink, Drink a, mojito a mojito and, and five, five more, more laps. laps. How these rats infuriate me. And I told you that the rats are infuriating. Let's have a mojito and run away. Oh, come on. Ice, we, we want, want a mojito. mojito. Yeah, guys, okay. I see you've lost 10 kilograms. Running is a sport. Maybe burger? Girls, is it my imagination or is it Abby there? You weren't imagining it. Oh, Bunny, hi. Are you visiting us? Welcome. Dima, will you come in for tea? Wow, Coach Abby doesn't waste any time. I know what all these dates are about. She wants to go back to the country house. I don't want this. Yeah, Coach Abby, we're going to our boyfriend. So, Abby, am I on my way? Okay, Dima, bye. No. Are you a coward? I'm not a coward, but I'm afraid to become like you. Bye. Abby, you can text me today. Bye. Fun? Well, now we'll laugh together. Boys, do you think they will kiss today or not? Why have they been gone so long? Zoop, don't worry. Even if they kiss, my friend will join us. Or Abby will leave this house. Boys, do you think it was better when the teenagers were not here or when they arrived? When the teenagers weren't here, it was quieter. But then we got girls. Hello, Hello boys. Hello, boys. Have you seen who Abby is walking with? First, there was Mr. Mike, then Smile, and now Dima, a football player. I wonder what she's looking for. Girls, is it okay for you to talk behind my back? Is it okay that I'm here? Well, girls got to us, right? Why did you deceive us yesterday? We were expecting you yesterday. So, Abby, how's the date with the football player? Abby, did you have a kiss with Dima? Can't you see it? Of course not. Dima's afraid of her. <laughs> I always knew that my ex Dima was a coward. Don't worry about me. I will definitely kiss Dima and leave this gloomy house. Zach, I don't understand. Is that all? Are you freezing me Where out? Where were you yesterday? 
Diana, there's a problem. Seep, why are you offended? We just gave the basketball players a lift and that's it. Abby told us everything she saw with her own eyes. Okay, guys, I'm kind of uncomfortable here. See you soon. Girl, since you're here, I've missed you so much, my bunnies. Oh, Coach Abby, how beautifully you lie. Let's have a party in honor of the fact that you came here. No, no we're, we're not, not in, in the mood. mood. Please calm down. We have a cool offer for you. We hope you will agree. In short, I suggest Zeep and all the boys who are here to go to my house. And I have a swimming pool at home. Diana's parents had just left, and we can arrange a party. I'm in favor, and I can call Dima. No, I'm going instead of Dima. Nastya, we will swim in the pool. Can you swim in the pool? We'll just swell up and pop up. So, are we going? Yes, yes we, are. we are. I'm going too, but shh, don't wake up Selena. I don't want to take her with me. Well, boys, take your swimming trunks. We'll hang out by the pool. Diana, will you give me a swimsuit? Nope, uh, of course I will. Guys, well, like, subscribe to our channel, click on the bell, and wait for our new pool series. See you all again, and bye! bye. Hang out!